അല്ല ഒരു Hello everyone, a very good morning, good afternoon and good evening to all of you. This is your host Vaibha. In uh, today's session we are starting a bit late as there were uh, disruption with uh, rainstorm happening here in Bali, Indonesia. Now that the internet and electricity is uh, back in place, I have started the session. So sorry for the delay. In uh, today's session we will be talking about uh, price pattern, the price action pattern which helps us in figuring out the opportunities where we can look for the trend reversal so this is a candlestick pattern using three candles and the name is um, two crows now this uh, indicator formation or you can say a candlestick pattern formation actually works uh, only one way which is to figure out the opportunities to go short so whenever we feel that there has been enough of run the price has opened quite high compared to the prior close in this uh, candle period and then it is continuing to go in the downward side for two consecutive candle this uh, formation takes shape and it is uh, named as two crows which uh, helps us figure out the short selling opportunity so let us now head to the j4x4 in which i will explain to you one formation with one example so this is the Barclays chart to find this uh, formation I had to do some of uh, work on the chart as it is uh, not easily available on the currency market forex instrument because in uh, forex we see that the markets run 24 hours but in case of uh, shares stocks you will have the gap up and gap down happening and as a result of that there it is a lot higher that the possibility is a lot higher that you will have this formation shaping up on the hourly formation so here i found one instance in barclays stock where we have this uh, gap up open if we compare this uh, candlestick at 10 gmt of 17th march which uh, opened quite higher compared to the prior closing candle and uh, then for uh, that candle and the next candle both uh, went into decline with uh, substantial losses and that indicated that uh, the prior run might be now coming to an end and it might be the time to initiate the short sale and that's how this uh, candlestick formation is considered it is uh, a indication that sellers might have kicked uh, might have now figured out that the prior run the upward momentum might be running towards its end and we can go for either the profit booking if you were long earlier or you can even think about initiating the new short sale trades with the expectation that the price is uh, likely to continue to decline for uh, coming next few candles so that's where this formation kicks in but as i said it is uh, difficult to find it in a 24 hours market and it might form only or you can say quite often during the economic uh, data release where there is sharp move on either side suppose if uh, in um, prior to the release if we had the continuous upward momentum and then after the release the initial tick is quite on the higher side but it uh, fails to sustain and uh, for next uh, couple of candle periods we see decline and if these two initial candles are in decline we will have these uh, two crow formation so that's one example here and um, we can't really do anything with uh, editing this indicator uh, not indicator this uh, formation is uh, simply derived using uh, the fixed input parameter so we take into consideration the group of three candlesticks and if we have this uh, first candle with uh, substantial gains or some gains with its closing value on the higher side 
compared to the opening price and then comes the next candlestick where the opening price is quite higher compared to the prior candles closing price but then it went went into decline and it uh, closed quite on the lower side and same momentum continued so we get double confirmation of the bearishness in uh, next two candles while in the first candle there is growth so it gives you the idea that uh, whatever gains were there in uh, initial time initial momentum those gains have evaporated or they can they can also say that it has uh, run its course and uh, with the subsequent candles closing on the lower side closing in decline you have the momentum which is on the lower side with uh, fresh bearishness kicking in it might be the time to initiate the new short sell trade with the possibility that uh, you might be able to profit from these uh, changing circumstances and in this case the stop loss will uh, be quite close you can give some buffer above the second candles high point and i think that should be quite good enough as the stop loss as we are banking on the continuation of the trend so there should not be any particular reason for the price momentum to turn on the higher side again and want to rise so that's what the expectation is and we expect this formation to continue and of course as is the case with any other formation there is not a full proof formation of course you will have some instances where it might uh, go in losses and that is going to keep happening from time to time so you have to consider that uh, there is a formation where you will have good profitability and uh, decent enough probability of getting the trade right but uh, always keep in mind that um, however good a formation is the trade can always go wrong so that's that is uh, something to be kept in mind while working with this now coming to the output you can uh, go for different types of color combination this is quite good but if you feel like you can go for a different color combination as well you can opt for brighter colors if you feel like okay so i have update for different color combination but it is not getting applied i don't know why maybe this time around it is uh, choosing to stay in its original color the styling combination is uh, this you can even go for a different color combination so your confirming candle will be colored differently and it will become immediately recognizable compared to other candlestick formations so this way you can try to highlight it all right transparency can also be increased or decreased suppose if you want to lower the transparency factor you can go for that or if you want to keep it prominent you can go for the opaque option all right then comes the recalculate on new candle only this is uh, not going to be much applicable it will be of course recalculated only on this candle once the confirmation comes into place highlight the time period zone you can't really do that as well as three candle formation it is and uh, that is going to be the case always so once you get this final confirmation that is all there is customization options are not going to be much helpful also the only thing is that you can vary these indicators uh, availability suppose if you want to keep the formation available on all the candle periods then you can do that or you can have this uh, formation only on chosen time frames that can also be done so that's the only editing option we have with this and uh, with this there is uh, not much uh, thing there is not uh, many properties which we can edit as it's a simple formation involving only 
three candlesticks and uh, as a result of that we have to play with this uh, fixed input and uh, of course the only output and all we can do is uh, opt for different shades of colors if you feel like and highlighting options but that's uh, there to it so that's all from my side for today's session if any of you have any query or any idea to share you can write back to me in the feedback section and i'll be more than happy to take the discussion forward before i sign off i would also like to remind of the risk associated with trading in the financial instrument and uh, i should be careful while dealing with any formation or any indicator for further coverage of the market developments do check out the Ducoscopy analytics page we are also available on the facebook you can reach out to us there too for trying out the newly released trading platform the link has been included in the bio so give it a try and uh, let me know how things work out for you so that's all from my side for today's session have a, have a fabulous weekend and uh, merry christmas in advance to all of you see you on the other side of the festivities on monday with a new indicator new concepts new formation everything will be new so do come back thank you all for joining in